Shana K. Let's train smarter, not harder. Today what I want to talk about is the simple plank, which is hands down the best core strengthening exercise that you can get. Uh, but there are, there's a right way to do it and there's an even better way to do it so that it's a full body exercise. So let's first of all go through the um, setup position for this. So I prefer the elbow plank to the high plank because it's a little easier on the wrists. And so the key is to keep the shoulders right over top of the elbows when we get into that position. So we want shoulder right over top of elbow. Now, we're wanting to engage through the back, through the core, through the quads, through the glutes. We can engage everything to make it a full body workout. So let's start with the toes up. So we're in a plank position where the shoulders are right over top of the elbows. Ears are right in line with the shoulders. You want your feet about hip width apart. Now the first thing you're going to do is you're going to uh, tighten the quads. Think about pulling the kneecaps up into the hips. And now you're going to squeeze the glutes. And now you're going to actively pull the elbows down to the hips. So this is in kettlebell training called a hard style plank, but we're just going to call it a doing it right plank where we're engaging through that entire body, belly button up through the spine. Now, the common errors in the plank that you're going to see is that the elbows, the shoulders are, are not on top, stacked on top of the elbows. Then the hips are going to come a bit higher. So we want to pull those shoulders over, drop the hips, and squeeze the glutes. So if you're engaging through the glutes, you can't have the butt up. Now, as people get tired, they tend to do this, especially if they lift the head. So you're gonna be feeling, they're gonna feel through the lower back. So you wanna have shoulder, um, you want everything in line between the shoulders, hips, knees, ankles, right from the ears, in fact. So again, we can modify by widening the base of support where you're still pressing those hips down, pulling those elbows to the hips, squeezing the glutes, or of course, we're gonna to go to that kneeling position where we really tighten the glutes. When you tighten the glutes, it presses the hips down. You can't have that mountain with the butt. That is the doing it right plank. Check your position. Uh, a mirror is awesome. If you've got a training partner, you can help with that too.